Hey everyone, it's Game Dev with Drew, and you know, I know, came from scratch, made a video on this, but I want my views and I want subscribers too, so I'm going to cover this anyways because I didn't even know that Godot had visual scripting. So that's why I'm going to cover it, because I feel like most people didn't know, because GDScript is so easy to learn. So, as you can see from the title of this video and just right here, Godot 4.0 is discontinuing visual scripting. It was a requested feature in Godot 2.1, and that was when Unreal Engine was porting into a visual script, and Unreal Engine did a very good job on it. Because not people, not many people learned like C++ and whatever. But visual shaders are still staying, and they're very easy to learn. If you guys want a visual shaders video, or just a shader video in general, I will definitely do that. Um, so they tried to go for like a blueprint style, like uh, Unreal Engine, which, you know, it, it's a good idea, except it didn't really work. It did not catch on, obviously, because I'd never even heard of it. And uh, it's just, you know, there's no popularity in it. 24 people, 0.5%. So if, if that's 0.5%, then I mean like divided by 0 0.005, if... if if 5,000 5, were polled and 80% people use this, like, that's kind of crazy. They're, they don't need to do this. Oh, it says it right here, 5,000 response. <laughs> um, just completely ignore my stupidity there uh, for doing the math. But um, GD script is, it's really good. You don't need to know visual scripting. Like, I mean, C Sharp is really up here as well, and so is C++. Like, I, hey... C++ tutorial for Godot, maybe? I don't know. I'm not the biggest C++ porting person, but I do love that language. It's my favorite language of all time. Um, so, yeah, they're just... They don't find a path to do it, and, I mean, I, I don't find any path to do it either. There's no reason to use it. If only 24 people have used, have used it as their main language, like, it's... Visual scripting is not useful, not useful at all. GDScript is really simple. It's Python-like, so it's one of the easiest languages to learn, and there's no reason to like have something like it. Um. Yeah, so I mean, they wanted to be like Unreal or Game Maker for high-level like visual scripting, but Godot is like you can do anything in Godot with code. As, but you can't do anything with visual script because Godot is more like a general purpose. Oh, it says it right here. Um, game engine. So you can make more than just games with it. So you don't even need... So the, they couldn't implement every single way to use it perfectly. So uh, they're removing it and maybe, maybe they're going to make an, an extension. If people moving over from Unreal Engine don't even know how to use it, then you know that you someone will someone will make an extension. I, I'm I'm one hundred percent sure of that. But um, they're they're just getting rid of it. It, it it it's such a good engine already, and I'm happy that they're focusing their resources on something else, because there's no reason to have visual scripting. Um, I find that visual scripting. It's only needed in Unreal Engine. I'm gonna be honest with you. Because Unreal Engine C++, it's not even like C++, it's literally its own language. It's just so bad in Unreal Engine, so that's why they use uh, node-based uh, visual scripting. But I, I find that this is good. Th this is good for Godot. I feel like Godot moving forward, they're going to be able to work their resources on something else, and, not as, and no one even knew about visual scripting anyways so it doesn't doesn't really matter i think this is an overall good thing if you disagree with me comment down below or leave a dislike i guess but uh make sure you're subscribed and join my discord and thank you to uh, andres or andrew for uh being a part of my patreon thank you everyone that's it